Jonathan, I'll start with you. How exactly did all of this happen? How was this able to happen? Uh, how it happened is because the president asked as many people as he could to get there with little or no guidance. That's the first problem. The second problem is that the Capitol P Police completely failed in their mission. And But the overall arching re reason that it happened that nobody's talking about in media is the fact that the American citizenry is angry. Yeah. They're angry on the left, they're angry on the right. And the people that showed up there are angry because they're oppressed. And if you think they're wrong, look at what's happened over the past 24 hours with social media and media. It's that simple. Uh, Jonathan, I mean, I guess, how do, you, how do you bring this down? How do you bring the temperature down? What do we do in this country to get this back to a normal place uh, where we're not just so crazy? Well, I'd recommend the government start doing their job, first of all. And uh, second, look, I'm a realist. That's the, the bottom line of this is that, uh, the, first of all, the people have to realize that they're the answer. Not the left, not the right, not the Democrats, not the Republicans. The people are the answer. And if uh, we, we know 70 million people at least voted for President Trump, if 70 million people stood up and said, we want the government to be what they were supposed to be, then the government would be what they're supposed to be. And the same thing with the left. If the left, uh, and I'm talking about the citizenry, realized they're being played just as hard, they would stop with this nonsense. And until that happens and until the people stand up and, and I don't want to say take the fight to government because I don't want to have anybody do that now, but until the people realize that they're the answer and if they stand together and, and insist on things like paper ballots, for instance, yeah. uh, hand counting, those types of things, we won't even be in these positions. Couldn't agree more. Couldn't agree more. Jonathan and Scott, guys, thank you so much for coming on. Appreciate it.